Traders in Bitcoin should stay away from this trap on price today. After a brief prong earlier this week, cryptocurrency prices came back down. Various experts we talked to said the prices would probably fall again despite the upward trend as pressure continues to mount from macroeconomic variability and a liquidity crisis among crypto firms. And that is exactly what happened. Bitcoin fell down $20,000 on Thursday, a near 8% drop over the last seven days. Ethereum experienced a big fall too, falling to approximately $1,000. The largest crypto is down more than 70% from last year's all-time high of $68,000. Fickleness is par for the course for crypto, and as Bitcoin has fallen below the key support level of $20,000, it could easily rebound back up. For the investors, there is a big question still lingering, and that's, is the crypto market on its way to come back, or is it just another false news, also known as a bull trap? Hey guys, welcome to Crypto World, where we tell you about traders and Bitcoin should stay away from this trap on price today. So stay with us till the end of the video so you don't miss out on any of this information. And before we proceed, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and click on the bell symbol so you never miss out on any of our wonderful videos in the future. And let's get started! Some expert signs point to a bull trap, and investors should be careful, warning the worst may be yet to come among ongoing macroeconomic uncertainty, and Bitcoin's price, as well as other cryptocurrencies, could fall even further. While we have watched Bitcoin and Ethereum rallies recently after making lows around $17,500 and $880 respectively, we are unsatisfied about calling a low in place yet. The actual risk environment remains on a knife's edge. While we think risk assets will rally, particularly toward the end of the year, we see risks jagged to one more sell-off first. Now comes a question, is the crypto market recuperating or is it just a bull trap? It's easy for investors to consider that the worst is in the past for the crypto market. Bitcoin's price kept above $20,000, and Ethereum held above $1,100 on Tuesday, a notable jump from their 15th month lows just two weeks ago. But with war engaged in Ukraine, which is rising interest rates, affectation soaring, and imminent talks of an impending recession, the coast is far from clear. Many are calling what we are watching with crypto prices this week a bull trap. That is when a stock or cryptocurrency comes back down after a convincing rally and breaks below a prior support level. Basically, it is a false signal which is fooling investors into thinking the market is done falling and that it is a good time to buy. Experts say there will probably be another sell-off in the crypto market over the next few weeks or months. Wendy O, who's a crypto expert and educator, believes Ethereum could fall as low as $750 and Bitcoin could fall to $10,000. Martin Hesbuck, who is head of blockchain and crypto research at Uphold, identifies whether Bitcoin holds above $20,000 has little to do with crypto itself and more with the entire geopolitical and macroeconomic situation, which he does not believe will improve notably in the short term. The crypto market, which has been following the stock markets lately, has been a victim of the broader market sell-off of risky assets. The war in Ukraine provides chain gluts, and affectation are by far the biggest worries. So far, Bitcoin has not exactly proven to be the inflation-proof safe haven its biggest fans believed it to be. Now let us see that is it a good time to invest in crypto? The crypto market's volatile and highly uncertain, so buying cryptocurrencies at any price is a risk, let alone a market dip that might not go away anytime soon. However, if you have assessed your tolerance and can accept the risk, experts say now could be a good time to get into the crypto market since prices are lower than they have been in years. There's no such thing as a perfect time to enter the market, so keep in mind that price fickles are par for the course and be prepared for crypto prices to fall even more. Do not invest in crypto if you cannot stomach sharp market swings, which can sometimes be as much as 15% in a 24-hour period. Additionally, you should invest only what you are okay with losing after you have prioritized other aspects of your finances, such as making an emergency fund and paying off high interest debt and investing in a traditional expiring account like a 401k. Financial advisors suggested investing no more than 5% of your portfolio in crypto and staying to the two most well-established cryptocurrencies. In accordance with the Next Advisor, investability score Bitcoin and Ethereum are examined to be better investments thanks to their long track records and long-term value growth amongst other key factors. Now, let us see about the bear trap. An overture to the short squeeze, a bear trap is a form of harmonized but controlled selling to create a temporary dip in an asset's prices. More often than not, beginner traders get caught out by price fickleness when trading in markets that deal with asset classes such as worth bonds or even cryptocurrencies. 
Although it is suggested to stay invested for the long term to write out such spells of volatility, price reversals can puzzle even the most experienced traders. This makes it important to recognize signs of a false reversal of a brief directional change in the price direction before continuing the underlying trend to avoid falling prey to them. Increased volatility can even tempt short-term traders into making multiple trades in an attempt to time the markets, outcoming in deep losses for most and impacting their confidence or judgment to the underlying asset. In a market that is heading upward, a sudden downward move in terms of prices can persuade increased volatility and may force market participants to either close down long-term holdings or go short on the basic asset in the hope of earning a quick buck. This reversal, if created by a group of investors selling in bulk, can be temporary and last for only as much time as is needed for them to repurchase their holdings at the least price. Known as a bear trap, this form of market manipulation swindles bearish participants into believing that the price reversal designates the start of a downtrend and is often followed by a sharp restart of the previous uptrend. Shorting, the practice of selling an asset to purchase it again later at a lower price, is extremely conjectural in nature during such periods of volatility and leads bearish traders to consider extreme amounts of risk. Since a bear trap is frequently sudden and short-lived, long-term investors also could buckle under the temporary selling pressure and penalty some or all of their profits. Same in mechanism as seen with other asset classes, a bear trap in crypto markets tempts both bearish and bullish bets frequently with disproportionate risks involved. Used to describe both the implementation and the short-lived price reversal, falsely citing the onset of a downtrend, a bear trap in crypto markets is a form of market manipulation that's brought about by joint efforts of a group of traders who hold massive quantities of the underlying cryptocurrency. By coordinating with each other, the collective selling off of a specific token causes its price to fall and influences other retail participants to trust that the uptrend is over. Many investors may sell their holdings as an after effect, and this results in the price falling even further for a few hours or days at an end. Usually on breaking below the formerly held lows, these influential trader groups will then begin to buy back the sold quantities at depressed prices, and this trips a sharp upward move that entraps bearish bets altogether. In an offer to limit their losses, traders with short positions would then scamper to buy the cryptocurrency, and the after effect of buying momentum only serves to take the price even higher. Thus, by selling at a higher price and buying again, all sold positions at a lower price level, the trader group or bear trap setters plan to profit from the difference without influencing influencing the quantity of cryptocurrency held by them in the long run. And that's it for today's video, guys. We sincerely hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please click on the like button and share it with all your friends and family. If you have any questions or comments for us, please share them with us in the comment space down below. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to see even more incredible videos from us. You can also check out our other videos that have been specially selected just for you. Hey, we'll catch up with you in our next video. Have a great rest of your day, and thanks for watching.